You may not think that VAT is an exciting topic, but there are some really interesting and quirky VAT rules that are sure to surprise you. Number one, did you know that gingerbread men are actually classed differently according to the decorations that are on them? If it has just two chocolate spots for eyes, then no VAT is charged, but anything else, the VAT rules apply. Number two, bumblebees are taxable under VAT, but honeybees get away scot-free. Number three, Chocolate shortbread has fat on it, but if you add a layer of caramel making it a millionaire's shortbread, it doesn't. Number four, how luxurious is caviar? Not enough to be subject to VAT. As a general rule, VAT is applied to luxury foods but not essentials. Whilst petrol, poodle food, orange squash and ice cream are categorised as luxury. Incurring VAT charges, HMRC have decided that lap dances, caviar and Labrador food are not luxurious and have no VAT. Number five, when you buy a coffin, there is VAT on that. However, transporting that coffin through hiring a hearse has none. Number six, spot the ball. A game developed by a betting operator, Sport Tech, was the subject of a VAT case at a court appeal in March 2013. Originally, HMRC viewed the game as one that required skill, meaning that it would be subject to VAT. However, Sport Tech appealed this, providing that the game was one of chance, meaning it was not subject to VAT. As such, HMRC made a £97 million VAT repayment in 2016, following various appeals to the courts. Number seven, children's car seats have reduced VAT rate of 5%, which seems strange charging any amount for the safety of your children. Number eight, Crisps also have funny rules. Potato chip snacks are subject to standard VAT charges. However, maize and corn-based snacks are exempt. This has led to high-profile court cases, such as with Pringles in 2008. Procter & Gamble, the parent company of Pringles, lost a court case. The company argued that since the product is made up of just 42% potato, that sales should be exempt from tax. However, a High Court judge ruled that there is more than enough potato content, meaning that there was tens of millions of pounds in the VAT outstanding. Number nine, some nuts, particularly those with shells such as pistachios and monkey nuts, are VAT zero rated. Strangely enough, deshelled nuts are all subject to standard VAT. Number ten, hot takeaway food and drink is subject to standard VAT, whilst cold food and drink are zero rated. However, hot takeaway food can avoid tax if it is being left to cool down and doesn't need to be sold or consumed whilst it's hot. This includes, for example, bread and pies in bakeries. The famous pasty tax in case 2012 led to a five-part test to decide whether to charge fat. So there you have it, 10 fun facts that show how complex fat is. If you're not sure about any part of that, it's worth speaking to an expert. If you have any questions at all about that, please get in touch and we can sort it out. If you'd like to see more videos where we answer lots of questions on tax and accounts, take a look on our YouTube channel. You can also subscribe for more videos.